Hello, best friend, and a welcome, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a fabulous day. This is the first time you're watching my channel. My name is Sebastian, and I welcome you guys with open arms as I fucking put down my damn arms, bitch. Open arms, okay? Get in here, bitch. Get in here with consent. Get in here, bitch. Um, If you are new, my name is Sebastian. Like I fucking just said, welcome back to my channel. I spill pop culture tea every day, and I'm your new messy best friend. I hope you're having a really good Sunday. I hope that today you get to relax. You get to eat all your fucking foods that you want to eat, bitch, because, ooh, just eating food making me so fucking excited okay what are you eating tonight bitch or if today's not your sunday because i know everyone has different schedules when your sunday or friday or saturday come your next day off what are you gonna eat bitch let me know in the comments right fucking now bitch right fucking now right fucking now okay okay um okay listen girl what in the willy wonka oompa loompa is going on here bitch okay so listen you guys know that um girl you know what I love a good lip gloss from Ross. Like, I, I love them. I, I, they're amazing. They're five bucks, whatever. But, like, they're so sticky that, like, I just feel like it's, like, a little too sticky, which I guess that's okay. But I'm, I'm, I'm a little scared to know what they're made of, bitch. Mom, don't, don't tell me in the comments. Um, anyways. Girl, Willy Wonka is going cray cray. So, you guys know that Kylie Jenner and Timothy Chalamet uh, officially made it um, official uh, recently and at the Beyonce concert and at the US Open, right? Where they were making out, girl, after he had that big ass cigarette, they were kissing like there was no tomorrow, bitch. And Chris Jenner was in the background, like the mean girl's mom, you know, she was recording. Um, no, but listen, so there, you guys know that there's this writers and actors strike right now where an actor cannot promote their movies. It is against the rules they cannot promote their movies they cannot talk about them they cannot uh, anything like nothing absolutely nothing no press conferences no interviews nothing not even on social media can they do that so right now girl there is a, a rumor going around that allegedly timothy chalamet allegedly decided to go official with kylie in order to stay in the press to freaking uh promote the movie bitch Oh, which, by the way, it's Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. The musical is coming out in December, which, girl, I'm low-key excited about. I actually don't kill me. I never saw Johnny Depp's version because I just really love the original. Like, I love the original. And Johnny Depp's just looked very different. It just looked very different. I, I remember watching the trailer whenever it came out. And I was just like, girl, um, I think I'm good. Like, I love him in girl, this chair. Why do you hate me so much, bitch? Oh, no, it doesn't want to make noise. It's every time I talk. Her and I, we, you know what? I, I've heard, get rid of it. Throw it away. Buy a new one. First of all, bitch, I, 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 one of these chairs is like 80 bucks at Ross, okay? So give me a little time, bitch. I don't have an OnlyFans account, okay, bitch? But if you want to tip me down below for the chair fund, go ahead, girl. And we can get a new chair. But her name is Bertha, and she means well. And I've tried to oil the bitch, but it's like she doesn't... Oil kind of does not work on her, bitch. But you're going to behave the rest of this video, right, bitch? Okay. So listen. The insider um, posted and wrote a very interesting thing where... It says here, there had been rumors of a Jenner and Chalamet pairing since the spring. Chris Jenner works hard, but that D, you know, <laughs> works harder. Um, but it, okay, so it says here that Chalamet fans have had a difficult time believing that their wispy boy is dating a Kardashian Jenner. And yet, just a few days ago, they were spotted again at the US Open full on PDAing in front of Laverne Cox. Um, it says here, I'm not here to question the validity of the Jenner Chalamet union. May this be the truest and purest love. May it last a thousand and one years and blossom into a thousand black zip up sweatshirts. This is only to say that the things of this hard launch offer Chalamet a convenient way to ensure his soft e boy haircut remains on our minds without breaking SAG Afra strike rules. Um, so of course, you know, this, this is a report and now of course, TikTok, Twitter, OnlyFans, uh, UFO, uh, Twitter that they probably have up there as well, bitch. Um, like everything, Zine on the girl for the next 21st century, bitch. Everyone is talking about this because it, it kind of like, 
in a way, it, it, I mean, listen, I don't want to say that, that this is it, but like, obviously it's going to get press. Obviously people are talking about Timothy Chalamet. If I'm going to be like straight up honest with the girl, I had no idea who this kid was. My husband knew him from a movie called Call Me By Your Name or Call Me Daddy's Name. I don't know what the fuck the movie, I never watched it, bitch, but I, I didn't know who this kid was until, and I thought he was a kid, bitch. I thought he was 14 years old. I thought he was 14, 16, 17 years old. I never watched Call Her My, my Daddy, Call My by your name by the way I, I don't know what it's about i've never watched it um but but you know i i didn't know i didn't know about him in any other thing like i you know it's one of those names you just like who is who is this you know so of course him when when the rumors started coming of kylie jenner and him like you know that's when you know i started talking about him and learning a little bit more about him <clears throat> I saw the trailer of Call Her, Call Me By Your Name, and so I can guarantee he's probably not under 18 years old. There's a lot of making out in that movie. But um, but no, so now he is the new Willy Wonka. You know, he he he's the movie's coming out, I believe, in Christmas Day. So it's a huge budget movie, and they cannot promote it. So, you know, it kind of makes sense what this article is saying. It's like, girl, of course he can't promote the damn movie with because of the strike rules. So he's gonna, you know, come out of the closet with Ke Kylie Jenner. You know, and, and, and come out of the relationship closet and just post it all, all over, you know, not post it, but get pictured in like the two biggest events that they know they're going to get pictured. So I don't know, you guys, it's one of those things where I'm just like, girl, could it be, could Kris Jenner have like a direct knowledge and direct contract with Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory, bitch? Could she be like a part owner? Does she get the, the Oompa Loompas? Like what, what, what really is happening here? Let me tell you guys something. When I first watched that movie as a kid, bitch, I will tell you, I had the biggest crush on Wonka. I've always had a daddy issue, bitch, always and forever. I've always liked older men, always have. And you know, it's just one of those things, I don't know, like for me, younger than me or my age i just cannot like i don't know why like i'm i'm all about like older you know what i mean although my husband and i are the same age and i am technically a little bit older than he is but you know what he is a lot more mature looking and more mature you know more get together i'm wearing sparkles he's more like more calm down and chill so in my eyes he's a daddy um girl that's a lot of information bitch but no but for real like it kind of makes sense in a way that you know kylie and and timothy you know are are going steady publicly and and you know of course it is definitely giving him press because anytime that someone talks about him they're going to connect the movie right they're going to be like charlie and the chocolate factory is the musical you know lead actor timothy chalamet and kylie jenner were spotted making out at an in and out you know with uh, in and out secret sauce all over themselves you know what i mean so of course it kind of gives you the name a lot more i'm definitely gonna watch the movie bitch i just it, i i'm gonna watch it because it really looks amazing it there's like magic in it it's sort of giving harry potter vibes i love it i'm so excited for the movie and damn it i you know when i'm really really fucking rich bitch i'm gonna make like a, a chocolate river man i would love to swim in that chocolate river with a environment friendly straw and suck that shit dry i'm gonna deep throat that damn chocolate but here's the thing you guys it has to be lactose uh free it cannot be dairy based because then we're gonna have an issue okay well i can have some flowers made out of lactate pills and i could just eat pop one of those in and you know just swim in the river <laughs> You know, oh, that'd be so amazing. You know, that really would be amazing. And then the guy who played the original Willy Wonka can be like my lifeguard in a Speedo. And of course, like I'll ask my husband if it's okay that he's there in a Speedo. And I don't know, is he alive? Oh my God, wait, did I, I don't know if he's alive, but if he's not, may I never disrespect him. I'm so sorry, but... Yes, I've always found him. So I gotta go, bitch. This video is just its just going all around, bitch. Listen, I hope you're having a fabulous day. I hope you are getting enough rest. Make sure to drink your water. Make sure to enjoy. Make sure to give yourself something that makes your soul happy, okay? Whether it's reading a good book, watching your favorite movie, calling a friend. Do something that makes your soul happy because we hardly ever take time for ourselves. So I want to make sure that you take some time for you. That something that brings you happiness and makes your soul laugh and giggle a little bit because you deserve it okay bitch all right so let me know what you guys think do you think that this relationship is being used as a promotional thing for willy wonka let me know in the comments i love you all very much thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys in my next video Mwah. bye